I don't know what's next. And I guess what you're seeing is uh, just a person who doesn't know what the hell is going to happen next. You know, I mean, I'm essentially lost at this moment. I'm like floating around and nothing is, you know, there's, there's absolutely, I and mean, this has been the way it's been for a long time, no evidence against me, no testimony against me, nothing. I've been in prison on nothing for years. And then now I'm in here with no conviction. And I'm still in prison, you know, and I don't know what's going to happen next. So, you know, I'm, I'm very cautious, I think. I'm, you know, I mean, I'm, I like to think I'm a manly man to some degree, but you know, I mean, I'm scared. You know, I don't know, I don't know anything about where I'm at right now. It's just the way the world is. So to me, it's like, you know, they have an agenda and I have an agenda. And my agenda is just to show the world about the facts of this case. And if I can do that, great, because then I'll get my freedom back. And then beyond that, hopefully they'll see that this is not an anomaly and that this happens all the time, all across the world, in every state in our nation. And, you know, there's a lot of innocent people in prison. So to me, I guess, you know, you find meaning in life. And one of my greatest meanings is getting out of prison, proving my innocence. But beyond that is helping other people not deal, other families not deal with the situation that my family and I have had to deal with.